How's it going guys? Good afternoon. Took a day off, man. I had some stuff to take care of, so why not do a couple updates and a couple reviews for you guys. So, it's raining outside too, so there's really nothing to do outside. Let me get back on this gain over here. That's what I was trying to gain a little bit more weight, because my metabolism is my enemy. It really does not like me to put on weight. And I'm a hard gainer, I'm sure a few of you out there are too. And we gotta up our calories, good calories, not just anything, to gain size and gain, gain some gain some mass pretty much so I tried to use this stuff and it had a good profile on it complex carbs essential fatty acids even had MCTs which is mm, I think there's multi-chain triglycerides or something like that anyway it's supposed to be good and 600 plus calories per serving which each serving was a uh, three and a half scoops so I was using as directed. I used one in the morning. I used one before I went to sleep. And I can honestly say I didn't gain any weight from this. I really didn't. I checked the scale in the mornings and after I finished the whole container and I'm still at 172. So what I noticed while I was taking this is when I mixed it up, three scoops, and shook it up in my container, it really did not taste like I was drinking anything. It was like water with cocoa powder in it. I mean, it really wasn't a, like a thick drink or anything that's like, oh, wow, I'm drinking a lot of calories here, a lot of substance or a, a meal replacement because it just didn't have it in it. It was basically just like drinking a protein shake. So I can't say anything that's bad about it, but if it's saying real gains, that should have gained at least an ounce or maybe a pound. I'm not trying to look for 10 pounds here, but give me something to keep me going and buying this product. You know, I'd like to have, you know, a little something to show for, you know, the money I pay for it. So, I'm sure they want you to use this continuously, you know, months and months on end. But if you're not getting anything out of the first sample of it, you know, why would you continue to use it? So, I went ahead and I went to Target, I was just browsing, you know, like I do looking at video games and stuff. And I came across this. And it was on sale. I was like, hell, might as well. I ran out of my other stuff. So go ahead and went with the Cytogainer. People that make, you know, muscle milk. And what it is is a lean mass builder. It's got per four scoops, you'll get 54 grams of protein and 55, 550 calories. And it has glutamine and creatine in it as well. So I love these company because of the packaging. It does have a great labeling system on it. Breaks down everything. Shows you little graphs and pictures and everything. Look real close, you know. It shows a little. This is what you do with two scoops. This is what you do with four scoops. You know, that's pretty neat. And what what I like about this is I'm not going to use four scoops of this stuff at one time. Quick story. I used a mass gainer about a year ago. It was from Dometize, and it had one of them huge scoops. And they said, take two of these. So I took it in the morning. I had to drive to uh, an account out in Richmond somewhere. And man, that stuff tore my stomach up. I was in knots. I mean, bubbles like you wouldn't believe. I couldn't burp. I couldn't pass gas. It was just like, oh, you're going to get fucked up. Oh, I'm sorry. Excuse the language. But it jacked my stomach up. So I was scared to take these, these gainers at their, at their recommended dosage because of that. I mean, it was the worst pain I ever felt. I mean, I, was, I pulled over, I couldn't even drive, it was so uncomfortable. But, it breaks it down for four scoops and two scoops, which is really good. So, out of two scoops, I'll get 27 grams of protein, I'll get 37 grams of carbs, and 280 uh, calories, and 1.5 grams of creatine. I'm going to take this at night before I go to sleep as a, pretty much a, like a casing type drink. Because the ingredients include, you got multidextrin, you got whey protein concentrate or isolate, uh, milk protein concentrate, got cocoa powder, L-glutamine, it's got some vitamin mineral blend, potassium, citrate, uh, got some soy leachin, it's got some gums, iodine, and it's got some uh, vitamin blend too. But it's got a lot of ingredients including a lot of vitamins. You know, it's almost like taking a multivitamin, there's many vitamins they have in here. They got A, C, calcium, iron, vitamin D, E, thiamine, riboflavin, zinc, vitamin B6, folate, vitamin B12. A lot of vitamins, man. But it's got potassium, sodium, and it's got some fats in it. But not a lot of sugars, only uh, 5 grams per 2 scoops, and it has 9 grams for 4 scoops. And you can take this 
you know, the optimal time, they say the optimal time for taking this is 30 to 45 minutes immediately after your workout. So you can use this as your post-workout shake to get some carbs and get your uh, protein in you. But I wouldn't take four. But that's what it says to do. And time is critical because muscles absorb approximately 80% of the aminos and carbs necessary to help them grow during the two-hour period immediately after exercise. For additional carbs, protein, and energy, take Cytogainer as a snack or meal replacement. And I'm going to take it as a meal replacement, maybe throughout the day and right before I go to sleep at night. And just to see how it goes. Because the other stuff, I just didn't gain anything, real gains. So maybe the Cytogainer can help me out. So I'll keep y'all posted on this one, still at 172, and I'll let you know if I go up to 173 or maybe 4. But I'll see y'all next time. Thanks for watching.